The ultimate disaster has struck our happy little household. I was perfectly content with just me, Mango, and Slave Emily. It worked well, and everything was humming along just fine. Then Emily did the unthinkable. She added a new cat to the household. Merlin is a Russian blue who came from a local store called Spellbound. He thinks he's going to be the alpha in my kingdom. I don't think so. He walked in as though he owned the place already. Emily is completely wrapped around his silky blue paw. He likes to hug and rub noses with our slave. Ugh! He treats everyone he meets like their long-lost friends. Speaking of that, he brought a few friends of his own. Fleas. Yuck! Who does he think he is? I thought I could count on my own boyfriend to be supportive. Mango is big, tough, and older than Merlin. At least I thought he was. After three hours, he rolled over and let the new guy play with him. Not only does he allow this, he acts like a cream puff and lets Merlin dominate him. Now they zip through the house together and pal around like they're BFFs. Where is the dignity? Where is the pride? Merlin is true to his name. He's woven an enchantment here. How do I break this evil spell? I've bopped him over the head more times than I can count, and it does nothing but make him think I want to play with him, too. I haven't given up. I will perch on top of my cat tree throne and come up with a plan. There's way too much kitty testosterone in this house.